Good morning. Good morning. It's what, like 7.30? 6.30. I'm Brandon. I'm Jess. And we're gonna go on another hike. <laughs> Pulling out of the driveway now. And uh, we're off to Mount Kunkamunga. I think that's how you say it. Yeah. I'm not the best at English, but <laughs> that's where we're going. So first we gotta stop and get a cup of coffee, but otherwise, that's all we need. Okay, here we go. Good morning. We're up at the Ice, Can Ice House Canyon uh, parking lot, and we had to park down the street, which is a bad omen for a day to park super far away. Uh, when you thought you were getting here early enough for it not to be an issue. <laughs> Yee, should be fun. But uh, I think there's a lot of people on this trail today which could drive us crazy, crazy, crazy. Because that very well could happen. <laughs> Just kidding. All right, bye now. <laughs> First mile, and seriously, it's an absolutely gorgeous uh, little canyon. Last weekend we were hiking Mount Baldy and that is what's called Baldy Bulk. And so we came up the right side of it to the top, had lunch, and then came down the left side. Um, it's just crazy to look at it and think, we were there! And now we're looking at it. All right, bye. Cool. All right, so we just made it to the top. This is, well, to the top of the saddle. Oh. Um, so we're gonna take a little breather, eat a cliff bar. Um, and we're gonna end up going that direction to Cucamonga Peak. But you can actually hit three different peaks from here. In fact, you can even climb to Baldy from here. Uh, so a quick trail debrief. Uh, scale of one to ten, uh, how pretty was it? Uh, up to the saddle, I'd say I I give it like a almost a ten out of ten. I know, right? So the first gorgeous. first up what three, three miles? Four miles up to here. First three miles is so pretty. After that, I'd give it like a seven or eight in terms seven of seven or eight, beauty, yeah. Because then you get great views. You're out of the woods. Yeah. You're up above. You're not above the tree line, but you're in the kind of scrag trees that are you know, snow line trees. Okay, scale of one to 10, how hard was it? Uh, two parts on this trail for like difficult level, I'd say again, from here up to the ice house saddle. Um, kind of anybody I, could do it. Yeah, anybody could do it. I'd give it like a five out of 10 maybe. Yeah, I mean, it you is know? all uphill, but It's all agreed. uphill, there are some switchbacks, but it's not impossible. Five out of 10 for sure. Yeah, and but then, then from, there from up, here to Cucamonga, I'd give it a, Seven. Six or seven. Six or seven out of ten. The trail is much more, um, well you know, well packed and clean, yeah. so it's not hard on your feet and your ankles. Mm -hmm. And the grade isn't that steep because there's so many switchbacks. So yeah. on that on that scale, it's yeah, six or seven out of ten for difficulty. For difficulty, overall, favorite hike in Southern California, scale of one to ten. I'd put it at probably That's pretty high. Maybe eight because yeah. for me the hike up is. It's just beautiful, really beautiful for a yeah. while. So anyway, Brandon and Jess here signing off. We'll see you next time.